Hello. This video is sponsored by Buddha and Bronson, who will continue to sit behind me, lick, snort and fart their way through this entire video. Why you ask? Because I don't have the heart to kick them out of this room. This is their house too and they belong in here. So they'll stay. Tonight I have uploaded my uh, bad eBay box. Uh, it was so terrible in fact that re-watching it while it was live uh, made me really really sad and I decided that I'm going to open up a box tonight, right now, at 10 to 11 at night on a Wednesday because you know what, I just need some happiness in my life. So I have this, I've got a Doki Doki box, I'm going to open it, it's full of good stuff probably because it usually is, it's going to be much better than one I got from eBay, um, not that it's fucking hard, I could go to pound shop and get stuff better than stuff the one from eBay. We're going to open this, it's going to be fantastic, uh, I mean it might not be a baby terrible. So I don't have scissors today, I've got tweezers. Um, for you who may not know, which is probably all of you, I film this at my makeup sort of beauty vanity table thing. So one half of this table is full of like hair stuff and this half is full of makeup stuff. Top drawer tends to always have like tweezers and like eyebrow scissors and stuff but I don't have, I don't, all I can find is this. So I'm basically using the sharp edge of that to open the box and it worked really fucking well so there you go. Doki Doki, as per usual, always the same shit every fucking day. We'll open it up, I'll show you a, a, a preview is the word I'm looking for. Um, I'll close it over, I'll look away as I take stuff out and then we'll judge it based on how happy and angry it makes me. So, there's usually some sort of leaflet. Is there a leaflet? No, it doesn't look good. Right, so that's, if you can see that, I don't know if you can, but that's the inside of the box. Again, I don't know if you can, it's a fucking hit or miss, really. So that's like a big plasticky thing. <gasps> I look so angry! What is it? Marshmallow? It's a marshmallow. Oh my god. Tonight I was at Yo Sushi with Yo Sushi with my friend Lauren, who is a vegan, and she we both plan on. That's going to say she and me, her and I, Lauren and myself plan on making uh, vegan marshmallows at some point uh, soon, and I'm very excited about it. So there you go. Right. Oh, he feels amazing. He's like. Well, first off, he's like an angler. Is it? Is it supposed to be an angler fish? Like an angler fish, like guy, like a marshmallow. Oh, he's great. It says touch it, and it's a wee hand feeling what looks like a marshmallow arse, which I'm into. But he is so squidgy, and he's very much like him. He's great. I like him a lot. But he is. Oh, my God, look at his face as well, though. It reminds me of like a character from Adventure Time. He's got one of those faces, do you know what I mean? Like he could be one of the candy people. He's fucking excellent. He feels great. Oh, I'm very happy with that. Right. I keep shaking this. I got myself some chocolate milk from the fridge. Nothing says opening a box of kids toys like drinking a carton of chocolate milk. I say chocolate milk, but it's definitely soy. Anyway, right. I need to remind myself that these boxes only have like two or three, sometimes four things in them, so I can't get that excited. Right. That is the leaflet, so that's fine. Where are you? Your ice cubes? That's cool. So that's straight out the fucking 90s. Do you remember when you used to get like the your mum and dad or whatever, if you're my age, your grands if you're younger, um, used to have, um, it was always like a kind of orange or a bit of watermelon or like a wee plastic strawberry and they'd put them in their fridge or freezer sorry and then they would um, put them in their drinks. That's what these are. They are tiny wee what look like dinosaurs. Tiny wee dinosaurs or tiny wee chickens and stuff but I think that's a dinosaur. I don't know why I said chickens, I just assumed they'd be chickens. I don't know why I assumed such such strange animal. Anyway, so there's there's a wee cat. 
and you basically put these in the freezer. What other animals do you get? Two things. That's a bear, which just looks like the cat, but it's the bear. And I think you basically get two of each. So you get six of these and you put them in the freezer and then you fuck them in your drink and you enjoy life and then you rinse them and then reuse them. Um, I think those are so fucking cute. And just to be extra as fuck, I'm going to take these to my friend Jay's barbecue at the weekend and everyone's going to judge me because everyone there is above the age of 30 and I don't care. I don't care. But I'm very happy. So they're cool. That is really cool. I enjoy that. Okay. So what else have we got? I'm trying to like, I'm trying to go in the box with like pincers so that I don't like feel it and know what it is. Oh! Oh, it's a wee push. Wee push guy. It's made of foam. It's made of foam. Bronson, get down. So yeah, wee push. He's nice. I like him. Right, so that should be like, there should be like one thing left probably. If any. Oh wait, oh wait, there's two things left. So I've got four things in my one hand, so I'm gonna take them both out. And you'll see there's there's nothing left in there. Right. A wee Hello Kitty notepad. And looks like a double-ended highlighter. So the Hello Kitty notepad basically has this picture all the way through. Uh, it looks like Hello Kitty in the sand with a, what, a, some weird fucking looking fish. Um, yeah, all the way through. And this says uh, Tuxedo Sam, and it is a blue highlighter and a yellow highlighter. There you go. That is the highlighters. So they, they work. Right, so that is everything that we have. So let's have a wee quick gander at the magazine. See if it gives us any other information. Obviously, the, all, every box you get tends to have like a theme, same as like the Kawaii box and stuff. So this one seems to be Kawaii Cove. So it's all like seaside stuff. I don't know why your um, highlighter is like a seaside thing. I can understand that that's obviously got fish on it. You put those in your glass. He's a penguin, so I guess penguin swim is that maybe the connection they're having? And I think he's an angler fish. Anglia? Anglia? I an angler fish. Um, but anyway, we'll have a look. So, Marshmallow Park Marine Plush, which is this guy, snuggle up to your friend in the sea with these jumbo sized mochi plushies, receive one five animals. You get a seal, shark, whale shark, coin fish, or angler fish. Out of all of those, I'm very happy I got the angler fish. He's cool. Right, okay, so then you get the purse. So it says Samiko Garishi Pouch. Uh, keep your money cards and. Well, keep hangs in it. Right. So Sumiko Garishi Ice Cubes, which was these guys, these are your average ice cubes, shaped like Sumiko Garishi Gang, blah blah blah. You get your scent scented marker, apparently it's scented. Now let's smell fuck. It smells like paper, so I, I don't know. Um, oh. It definitely smells, but this smells like sweet. I'm going to put a bit on my hand. Yeah, it just smells sweet, like, but nothing, it doesn't smell like a sweet mint or a sweet banana or anything, it just smells like sugar. Oh. So I guess that one smells like, like a raspberry sweetie, maybe? God knows. They, yeah, they smell a wee bit. So yeah, that's your, your um, Tuxedo Sam scented marker, and then you've got your Hello Kitty Marine notepad. Yeah, and that's it. So that was pretty cool. I really, really enjoyed that actually. I like it, just even just for this guy. Like, look at his face. I like it. So that, that was good. I mean, I, I really enjoy these two. I won't use this. I won't use the highlighter or the purse, but they will go in the drawer when I collect all the stuff that I won't use. And then whenever uh, my nieces come, they can just take what they want. Eventually, I might even just give it all away. 
um, or I could do giveaways or something like that if you want to do want me to run giveaways a giveaway competition where one of us, me or Mark, whoever picks the winner and I send you all the stuff and you batter in I can, I'll do that, let me know in the comments if you want me to do that I don't imagine you would but so that was that usual stuff that you see at the end of the videos I can't really bother saying Twitter, Patreon, fucking things they're all there if you want to look at them one thing I will say before I go is that alongside this Doki Doki box which comes from Japan Crate um, they also do a box called Kira Kira box which is this right I get this alongside but I never review this because it's not something I feel confident enough to review point being is that it's all skincare but what I'll do I mean also before I say this this video is not sponsored by them whatsoever um, I don't get these boxes for free I buy them but Kira Kira box basically has a lot of Korean skincare and stuff in it I use this stuff I like it um, I'm just going to show you inside it because I've got it in front of me anyway so I might as well show you it. Same shit applies, you get a box full of stuff and you get a magazine, right? So again I can't review this because it would mean having to physically use it, wear it, then come back and then tell you how it went. So like show you the innards of the box and go here's the stuff and then fuck off use it and come back. It's just not something that I feel confident that I know that I can do correctly and properly but I'll show you what stuff anyway so this is a looks like a cinnamon roll keep cool pad but I, I, I mean I would use that in your lunch box I don't know why it's in your kira kira whatever so cinnamon roll keep cool pad so that's cool a cool foot scrub peach is what it says so it's obviously a foot scrub um, I'm going to open it smell I mean if I can get the fucking thing open there we go Oh, well, that smells nice. It smells, it smells proper peachy. So that smells really nice, and I will use that. This is, it says bath salt, two pieces, and it's in the shape of a watermelon. So I assume when you open a watermelon, it'll have two packets of bath salts. So that's what that is. We have a foot mask which is very cool but very 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 strange I do have feet masks and have used them in the past they're fucking weird um, and this is fuck knows it says bangs sheet mask make your sticky hair smooth and keep your hairstyle beautiful that's what it says on it if this is something that you put in only your bangs which in Britain you would call a fringe I'm fucking using this right now and showing you because that's exciting, right? Well, I say exciting, this is fucking strange. Uh, bang sheets. Keep your hair looking clean and oil free with these bang sheets. They're designed to be the perfect and easy on the go hairstyle fix. They contain sebum absorbing powder and botanical extracts to remove daytime sweat oils and stickiness. I mean, I don't know about you, but I don't tend to ever get like stickiness in my fringe use them as part of your bangs layers or any part of your hair that needs a quick refresh fuck it let's get that go this non-reviewing uh video came in it just happened to be a, a wee quick a wee quick review for my bangs it smells like an old lady um also just to show you it actually has a picture of someone running it through the fringe so there's that. Uh, I mean, my hair is pretty clean. Um, I'd say pretty clean. I mean, I washed it yesterday. Right. So it's basically just like a fucking. Do you know? What? It's like a mixture between the the things you put in your your dryer dryer sheets to make your drying smell really nice, like a tumble dryer, and a face wipe. But it is so perfumey that I wouldn't put it on my face. But I'm just going to put it right next to my face. So fuck it. Let's see. Uh, right, we'll take a bit right in the middle. Yeah, we'll take this bit right. Fuck it. Let's see if it actually does anything. I mean, if anything, it just made it wet. Yeah. So now I've got a wet fringe. Right. So that was fun while it lasted. So the rest of the stuff in here. Cool foot scrubs. It's a season for bare feet. 
full, then it's, it's got like a full couple of sentences about how you should use this scrubby thing. Great. This thing, um, an adorable cinema roll ice pack to help keep you cool this summer. It's reusable, compact and versatile. Use it to cool down, soothe sunburns, brackets, oops. Or keep your summer snacks cold on the go. A cold compress is a natural remedy for the skin. So they expect you to take this wee, freeze it, take it wee in the off chance you burn yourself. Oh, Keep your like, bottles and shit cool. So whatever I do, well, that's fine. Watermelon bath salts, watermelon juice, um, extracts mixed with Japanese peppermint to oil to create refreshing bath salt. Turn your bath into a watermelon juice colour and smell of sweet fruit. Okay, so, hi. That's that, right? Like, again, I don't plan on showing you any more of these boxes. It was just sitting in front of me and I thought the last two videos were so pish that with the, the eBay um, boxes that I thought I would just give you this one wee extra. If you actually like seeing the stuff in this box, I'll show you if you want, um, because I get them anyway. I won't be able to review half the stuff. It was just a fluke that I got to rub that crap in my hair. Um, so yeah, let me know anyway. But thanks very much for coming to see this video. I really hope you liked it. I'm sorry there was so much noise about the dogs. I just didn't have the heart to like, lock them out. I just wanted them in here. I just, I just felt like they should be here. And... Um, yeah, thanks for coming to see this video and I'll, I'll, I'll see you later. Bye.